I now want to express as matrices. Okay, here they come. So now this is elimination matrices. Okay, let me take that, let me take that first step, which, wh which took me from 1, 2, 1, 3, 8, 1, 0, oh, 4, 1. I, I want to operate on that. I, I want to do uh, elimination on that. Okay. Okay. Now I see. I'm, I'm remembering a, a point. I want to. I want to single out as 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 uh, specially important. Let me let me move the board up for that. Because when we do matrix operations, we got to like be able to see the big picture. Okay, last time I spoke about the big picture of when I multiply a matrix by a right-hand side. If I have some matrix there and I multiply it by three, four, five, let's say, so here's a matrix. What did I say? Well, I guess I only said it on the videotape, but do you remember? how I look at that matrix multiplication. The result of multiplying a matrix by some vector is a combination of the columns of the matrix. It's three times the first column. It's three times column one, plus four times column two, plus five times column three. Okay, I'm going to come back to that multiple times. What I wanted to do now was to emphasize the parallel thing with rows. Why? Because all our operations here for this, like this two weeks of the course, are row operations. So I have to, so it, this isn't what I need for row operations. Let me, let, me, let me do a row operation. Suppose I have my matrix, again, and suppose I multiply on the left by some, let's say, 1, 2, 7. Again, I'm just like saying what the result is. And then we'll say how matrix multiplication works, and we'll see that it's true. Okay. But maybe already I'm making, uh, I'm sort of bringing up the central idea of linear algebra, is how these matrices work by rows as well as by columns. Okay, how does it work by rows? What, what, so this is a, that, that's a row vector. It's a, it's, I could say that's a one by three matrix, a row vector multiplying a three by three matrix. What, what's the output? What's the product of a row times a matrix? And okay, it's a row. A, ro a column, a, 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 sorry, a matrix times a column is a column. So matrix times yeah, matrix times a column is a column. And we know what column it is. Over here, I'm doing a row times a matrix, and, what, and what is the, what's the answer? It's one of that first row, so it's one times, one times row one plus two times row two plus seven times row three. When, as we do matrix multiplication, keep your eye on what it's doing with whole vectors. And what it's doing, what, what it's doing in this case is it's combining the rows. We have a combination, a linear combination of the rows. Okay, I want to use that. Okay. Now, so my question is, what's the matrix that does this first step, that takes, subtracts th 
3 of equation 1 from equation 2. That's what I want to do. So this is going to be a, a matrix that's going to subtract 3 times, times row 1 from row 2. And leaves the other rows the same. Ju just, in, I mean, the answer is going to be that. So whatever matrix this is, and you're going to like tell me what matrix will do it. It's the matrix that leaves the first row unchanged, leaves the last row unchanged, but takes three of these away from this, so it puts a zero there, a two there, and a minus two. Good. What matrix will do it? It's these. It should be a pretty simple matrix, because we're doing a very simple step. We're just doing this step that changes row 2. So actually, row 1 is not changing. So tell me how the matrix should begin. 1, so the first row of the matrix will be 1, 0, 0. Because that's just the right thing that takes one of that row and none of the other rows, and that's what we want. What's the last row of the matrix? 0, 0, 1, because that takes one of the third row and none of the other rows. That's great. OK. Now, I suppose I didn't want to do anything at all. Suppose my row, well, I guess maybe I had a, a case here when I already had a 0 and uh, didn't have to do anything. What matrix uh, does nothing, like just leaves you where you were? Uh, if I put in, if I put in zero one zero, that would be, that would be. That's the matrix. What's the name of that matrix? The identity matrix, right? So it does absolutely nothing. It just multiplies everything and leaves it where it is. It's like a one, like the number one for matrices. But no, that's not what we want because we want to change this row two. Uh, so. What's the correct? What should I put in here now to come out to do, to do it right? I want to get, what do I want? What am I I'm after? I want to subtract my, I, I, I want three of row one to get subtracted off. So what's that row, what's the right matrix to finish that matrix for me? Negative three goes here. And what goes here? That one. And what goes here? The zero. That's the good matrix. That's the matrix that takes minus three of row one plus the row two and gives the new row two. Should we just like check uh, some particular entry? H how do I check a particular entry of a matrix in, in matrix multiplication? Like suppose I wanted to check the entry here that's in row 2, column 3. So where does the entry in row 2, column 3 come from? I would look at row 2 of this guy and column 3 of this one to get that number. That number comes from the second row and the third column, and I just take this dot product, minus 3, I'm multiplying, Minus 3 plus 1 and 0 gives the minus 2. Yeah, it, it works. So we got various ways to multiply matrices now. We're, we're sort of like informally. We've got by columns, we've got, well, we will have by columns, by rows, by each entry at a time. But it's good to see that matrix multiplication when one of the matrices is so simple. So this guy, is our elementary matrix. Let's, let's call it E for elementary or elimination. And let me put the index as 2, 1, because it's the matrix that we needed to fix the 2, 1 position. It's the, it's the matrix that we needed to get this 2, 1 position to be 0. OK, good enough. So what do I do next? I need another matrix, right? I need to, I, I, there's, there's another step here, and I want to 